DB and Conway. Good morning, guys. I was supposed to pick up Melly from the hospital a couple days ago, but I had all these issues with the hospital. I don't even want to get into it. It was just so frustrating. Um, yeah, so finally, after dealing with one situation after another and another and another, I mean, like, I do appreciate all the work that the hospital has done for my daughter, but just some areas of the hospital just caused me a great deal of trouble the last week. So finally, I was supposed to bring her on Wednesday. It is now Saturday and I'm bringing her home. I'm bringing her some blankets and stuff because it's chilly outside and she already has her coat and stuff at the hospital. I'm gonna go, one of the issues was yesterday trying to get her prescriptions. One of the prescriptions that she needs like has to find a special pharmacy. So I'm about to head over to that pharmacy. They gave me the address to get the other prescription. I already filled the other one last night, but they wouldn't let me pick her up yesterday until I filled the other prescription because she needs to, I need to like break both of them to the hospital, show that I have them so she can go home on them. Um, yeah, just craziness. So I'm gonna go pick up that other prescription and head on over there. And Melly's coming home today. I'm so excited. I've had her stuff up, guys. And I'm just ready for her to come home. Welcome home, Melly. When you watch this, when you grow up, I love you so much, and I've waited for you for so long. And you are such a strong warrior, and such an amazing little girl. And I can't wait to finally have you. Instead of like thinking about you all the time and having to visit you, I get to have you and hold you and snuggle you and kiss you and this day. I've been waiting for for so long. You are such a strong little fighter. You're my miracle baby. You are my inspiration in life. I love you so much. I took Grandpa along with me, and we're gonna go get Millie. Finally, I'm so excited, right, Grandpa? Yay! Yay! You excited to be home, Mel? How are you feeling? I changed her because she decided to poop on her cute little outfit, but that's okay, right, Mel? You get in your pajamas, huh? And hang out with mommy, even though you really stink. And that poop was. How do you like your bed, Miss Millie? Oh, you like your little crib. Mm. 
You like everything? Is it pretty for you? Look at you. So great since she's got home. She made two poops. <laughs> she ate like crazy and I'm trying to get her to go to sleep now. She falls asleep in my arms, and then once I put her down, she wakes up. Just like she was in the hospital. She's too cute. My little piggy. My little piggy. Did you get a good night, guys. We're gonna try to go to sleep, right? I'm gonna try to get her to sleep, and then um, just keep watching her. I love her. I'm so happy she's home. I'm so happy this day has finally come. I'm just so happy right now. I can't, I can't express it. Like, this is just amazing. So, thanks guys for watching and praying for me this whole time. And Mel and just helping me get through everything. So, please comment, like, and subscribe and hit that notification. I mean, hit the bell for more, more notifications from our channel to see how this little girl grows, a part of our family. She thinks she's so cute. Bye, guys.